The Legend of Shaka Zulu, Warrior, King, and Unifier Welcome to this epic journey through time as we unravel the incredible story of Shaka Zulu, the revolutionary who forever changed the face of Southern Africa. Let's get right into it. Shaka Zulu was born in 1787 to a Zulu chief and a princess from a rival clan. His birth itself was scandalous, leading to his and his mother's exile from his father's clan. Relegated to his mother's Alangini clan, young Shaka faced humiliation and torment, fueling the rage that would later define him. Seeking a way out, Shaka left the Alangini and joined the Mthethwa clan. Under the tutelage of Chief Dingaswayo, Shaka honed his military skills, quickly rising through the ranks. He served as a warrior for six years, earning respect and admiration. He revolutionized warfare techniques, introducing new weapons and formations that rendered old tactics obsolete. When his father died in 1816, Shaka seized the opportunity and, with military assistance from his mentor, claimed his father's chieftaincy. In 1820, Shaka avenged Dingaswayo's death by defeating the Ndwindwe clan in the Battle of Malachu's River. He then set out to forge the largest state in the history of Southern Africa, incorporating rival Zulu-speaking clans. In 1827 his rule turned increasingly tyrannical after his mother's death, leading to the brutal treatment of his own people. His increasingly erratic behavior made him many enemies, leading to his assassination in 1828 by his own half-brothers. Though his life was marked by both glory and tragedy, Shaka Zulu's impact on African history is indelible. He was a military genius, a statesman, and above all, a legend. Thank you for joining us today to explore the life and legacy of Shaka Zulu. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more legendary stories. Catch you in the next episode. Thank you for watching. Enlightenment Quest.